Hey everybody, how you doing? Denimi, you here, Focus Coach, and today we're going to talk about one word, and the word is pacing. Yes, we're going to talk about pacing today, pace. Uh, before I talk about the word pacing, let's talk a little bit about what I talked about last week. Last week I talked about the word anger. So some people around you are going to be angry, angry of your success. Some people don't want you to succeed. Some people are going to be jealous, jealous of your level of focus, jealous of your level of determination, jealous of the time you spend performing the right activities for you to reach your goal faster, quicker, and further. Anyway, excellent video. If you haven't watched it yet, I would recommend you do so. At the end of this video, I'm going to put a link right here on the top right, right beside my books, and uh, you're going to be able to click on the link, put a comment, and tell me I'm right. I always like to hear it. So today I want to talk about, uh, about pacing because most of us, when we are really excited about a new project, a new goals or a new uh, adventure, we have tendency to give it out, right? We start really, really strong and eventually then we lose the focus, the motivation level goes down a little bit and some of us quit. Uh, and that's not what we want to do. We want to pace ourselves. Let me give you an example. I watch an MMA fight this weekend. If you don't know what MMA is, it's UFC. It's fighting without the, with mini gloves and the, the rules are pretty limited. But uh, I'm watching this fight, two excellent fighters, two excellent fighters with the right skills. And um, the only difference was one fighter was able to manage his energy better than the other one. Maybe it was a lack of experience or something, but the fighter came, who lost the fight came in on the first round and he, he was all in. It was full out, a bang, 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 non-stop for five minutes. It was impressive, actually. Second round, pretty much the same. Third round, oh, he's getting a little bit tired now. And the other guy is so solid. He saved his energy, right? He managed it better. By the fifth round, he couldn't do anything. He had a hard time to protect himself. He ended up to, lo to lose the fight. It's the same thing in our business. We need to regulate our daily activities. So if you ask me what pacing me in business or for my goal setting, I will tell you it's regulate my daily activities. So what's that mean? Well, I'm going to tell you, if you take a piece of paper right now, you take a circle and you put your goals on top and you say, I got three things I need to do every single day in order for me to reach a goal. Activity one, activity two, activity three. And uh, I want you to put a certain amount of time that you want to spend doing this activity every day. Look, there's no point to go to the gym three hours or four hours or seven hours in one day if you don't go for the next two, three, four weeks. This is nonsense. It's too much in one day, right? What is better is to go to the gym 20 minutes every day for the next three months or five days a week, whatever. That's what I'm talking about. So activity one, activity two, activity three, how much time you're gonna spend on that? I always start slow, but I put 10 minutes and do 20, then put 45 and do 10, you're gonna feel better. The next thing I will say, if you want to go to the next level, decide where you're gonna do it and when you're gonna do it. Instead of saying, I'm gonna do 10 minutes uh, mid station every day, do it, I'm gonna do it 10 minutes sitting on that chair every morning after my coffee. It's gonna help you to get there. All that to say that when you uh, manage your pace, when you regulate your activities, uh, you're going to reach your goal faster. It's going to be easier for you, first of all. The second thing is you'll be extremely more focused because you get a lot more focus 10 minutes a day versus 10 hours a day. You're a lot more focused on the first 10 minutes and you're going to achieve more. Guys, that's pretty much what I have for you this today. Uh, if you want to talk to me, email me. Here's my email right here, Denny at focus one is all coaching. Uh, dot com Denny at uh, one focus one is all coaching dot com and uh, if you want to spend a let's say you want to spend an hour with me if you have a goal you haven't reached for it right now if you need clarity I get a very good exercise I'm gonna spend an hour with you and uh, we're gonna do a clarity exercise and uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna make sure that you have a mini plan of action for you to reach one of you goal faster quicker and further uh, the only thing you need to do is text the word PROSPERITY at 26786. PROSPERITY is the word 26786. In the meantime, uh, I'm going to say stay well and uh, stay focused on what? On what you really, 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 really want. See ya.